Hey guys, this video I wanted to analyze Dragon Fight, how it came to it, how it went on, and everything else around it. So I had to lane against Bigger, and it, as Karin, it's just super annoying. So I was like, alright, we can gank bot lane. It's because this lane is such a pain, man. <laughs> However, so I um, go to this brush. And camp in it because they had no vision onto it. And Callista baits <laughs> the all in from them. And yeah, well, they failed for it, but it was pretty obvious. So I got the reset of Jinx and you know, pretty much free kill. So I back off and go back to the mid lane. That's another way how you can lane against Victor, by the way. Just roam and roam and roam and maybe tell your jungler to um, camp in lane. And this guy is like super nice because. Look at this. Just look at it. They froze the lane for me. Like, well, what a good guy. <laughs> Whatever. So, um, Kalista decided to push the bot lane tower and Velkos backed off. So, um, this was bot side because he just donated the blue buff up to Victor or never mind. He just stole it with W passive. Whatever. So, um, Kalista decided to go for the mini wave. And this. I was like, alright, we can catch her. And he used the sneaky gank path by eating over this. But unfortunately, he was boarded, so Kalista backed up anyway. And he tried to hit his ult, and yeah, it, it connected, so it's yeah, it's pretty much a free kill now, and Jinx ult finished the job. So they want to go for Dragon now. Um, he sweeped this brush because he knew that there was a ward, but unfortunately, it just timed out. Um, they want to get the scatter crap now. But unfortunately they missed this pink board, so we still have vision on them, so Vekos went for it, and yeah, he plays a ward here. So they started the drag now, and then they realized, oh no, we gotta clear that pink ward first, so we have to back off. But they didn't really pack, back off this fight, so they still tanked the drag and Vekos, the rest are fist here, and yeah, well, they should really back off at this point. However, they kept going for it, and... But then they realized that's a pretty bad decision because we we're, were coming in, move bandage shots to the Leona and then flash to get the old on Fizz and Jinx off. And Katarina came in, which is me by me. <laughs> and I ward jumped to get close to Fizz, who was pretty low. And at this point, Leona eat me. And I had to get out to prevent getting CC'd and. Yeah, well, not die and also to secure the kill on Jinx. So yeah, I got this, I got the kill on her, and Victor one shot at the Velkos here. For the E connected, yeah, yeah, he just got the kill. So I'm a moment, I we want to chase the Victor now, and he lay, he lay down whatever. <laughs> um, he uses W and I jump to the ward um, to get to prevent getting stunned by him. And Jax is coming in, so it's a 2v2 now, and I know that Emu is able to fight him, so I just decided to cap go, uh, to go for the victor, and Emu decided to do the same, unfortunately he missed his Q here, but it should be fine. But I'm in trouble now, because Jax jumped onto me and Emu already backed off, so I have to get out as quickly as possible, so I use my W for the movement speed, and then I gotta get the reset on the victor. And I'm over helping, but the EQ would have got the anyway. And then I jumped to the minions to get out, and yeah, well, I got out. So that was a pretty close fight at the end, but well, it was a good fight for us and a pretty bad decision of them to, uh, to keep going for the dragon, but whatever. It was 4 for 1 now, I think, yeah. So we won 4 for 1, and we get the dragon later on and snowballed the game out of that. Um, score was kinda even before the fight. Now it's, we have a lead and yeah, we snowball and win the game after that. Okay, whatever, that was it guys. See you later. Bye.